32,000 plus on their feet at Veterans Stadium. One ball and two strikes. Here's the one-two pitch. Line drive, free grab! A voice isn't a complicated thing. Any one of us can open our mouths and make a noise. But to be the voice? <laughs> now that's a gift. The voice that warmed every Philly fan's home for nearly 40 years fell silent on April 13th, 2009. Harry Callis, the voice of the Phillies, gone forever. Phillies president David Montgomery put it best when he said, We lost our voice today. But Harry Callis was more than just a voice. He has impacted every Phillies fan since 1971, and he has called every great Phillies moment since then. Every home run called by Callis sounded special, and nearly every fan has an impression. Swinging an 0-2 pitch. This ball's deep, right center field. This ball is out of here. It's out of here. It's out of here. We're out of here. We're out of here. <laughs> Home run, Mickey Morandini. Chase Utley, you are the man. So many fans have their own impression because Harry Callis has interacted with millions of people. While he met his name calling games on the diamond, many people are familiar with his voice from other areas. I think he was yeah, great he for, was NFL. Out for NFL films. Yeah. And, yeah, I mean, just his voice, NFL. just his, you know, the way it carried and, you know, just he was heard around the world. He did NFL films, uh, he did college basketball, and uh, he did commercials. Uh, he was just the voice, he was the voice, you know who he was, you didn't have to ask. But how did this Illinois native become one of Philadelphia's sons? After 38 years and over 6,000 games called for the Philadelphia Phillies, fans felt as if Callis was a member of their own family. My neighbor across the street from me used to listen to the Phillies on the radio. Mm -hmm. I saw him, when I was a little kid, he sit on his step and listen to Harry Callis and Woody every night. He was the voice of my childhood. I mean, I grew up listening to him since I was like five. Ocean waves and Harry's voice. Yes, it absolutely. Was... Summers and Wawa. I mean, I was devastated. My whole family was. I called my dad immediately and he was crying and. I've only ever seen him cry a couple of times in my whole life, and my mom, my sister, everybody, we were all pretty hysterical. In Philadelphia has always been known to be tough on everyone, from players to coaches. No one was spared, but not a single person has a bad thing to say about Harry Callis.